everyone, we're back with a new Fit Snack Box to check out for the month of November 2019. So if you're not familiar with my Fit Snack reviews and unboxings, go back and check out some previous videos. They're all pretty consistent, but that way you can get a good idea of what to expect in each box, which is basically a little curation of some healthy snacks, foods, you know, things like that. Um, so with that being said, let's get started. You can expect your box to show up in the mail like this, your shipping label on the opposite side of the box. So this is exactly how it comes. So you can see it's still sealed up. I'm gonna go ahead and open that for you. Get our box open. Okay. And as with our previous months, we, you can see that we have a little card that kind of outlines what comes in the box. A small little picture, the name of the product, some brief information along with their website in case you're interested in purchasing more or you could probably find some of it at your local stores. And then if you flip your card over, you will see a little workout suggestion, which is different every month. And you'll see this if you check out past videos. So you'll have a full body warm up, round one, round two, um, little trainer tip. It's always different. Um, so you're not going to get like sit ups, jumping jacks, the basic usual workout stuff. So with that being said, let's check out what we have in this particular box. To start off, we have some organic chickpea puffs, uh, vegan white cheddar. I've actually tried these before. They're pretty good. Uh, similar to cheese, like the cheese ball puffs, but obviously it's a, this is like a healthier version and a slight bit different texture, but just to kind of give you a comparison of what to expect with this. So these are actually pretty good. I've Every time I've gotten them, I've eaten them and love them. Next up, I have this, let's see, chickpea snack, gluten-free kosher uh, chickpea snack, sesame honey, gluten-free, dry, roasted, non-GMO. Sounds pretty healthy. See the back of it. I'm kind of curious how this tastes. So I'm going to peel this open. Super easy to do. I just peeled it off and no scissors needed. And you can feel there's actually a resealable part of the package so I can actually try some now and then seal it up to eat and snack on later. Yeah, I might actually need some scissors. See it's not really peeling apart. Separate. Let me grab some scissors and kind of cut a little closer to get this open. Alright so you can see a little resealable design right here with our snacks. Yay. So these look interesting. Almost kind of looks like a treat for a pet. Really small. Mmm. Really good. Really good. Good flavor. These will not last long, but to save y'all the trouble of hearing me crunch and talking with my mouth full on camera, I'll eat these after I make the video. Um... Next up, I have this My Gut Mojo Digestion Aloe Leaf Cinnamon, Cinnamon Cranberry and Hibiscus Lemon Herbal Wellness Shot. I've never heard of this before. It sounds pretty interesting. Kind of curious. So let's see. Some nutrition facts. It's 25% juice shake well. See, I see ingredients that doesn't tell me any instructions. Let me see. So this is where your card will probably come in handy that I showed you, which you can see down here. Let's see. It's a ready-to-go wellness shot packed with powerful herbs, juices, and plant extracts. A gut-loving combo. Um, I'll let y'all see that in the camera. Juice for overall immunity and antibacterial properties and inflammation. And drink to your health. So... Um, kind of curious. Do I just drink it like this or do I want it cold? Do I drink the whole thing? Um, I'll do some research, but I'm going to actually just kind of, I'm going to shake this up and at least take a little sip. Now let's see how it tastes. So 
see. I'm not sure if you'll, there we go. Kind of look in the bottle. I do like the bottle. It's cool. It smells pretty fruity. Uh, interesting taste. I don't, I couldn't drink it as a drink, but obviously it's supposed to be like a little shot type of juice, not a, you know, a juice for you to sip on and enjoy, I guess. It's interesting. I kind of want to try more. Kind of thinking I want to cool, chill it first before drinking it at room temperature. Pretty cool though. I have not seen that and I'm really liking the uh, the bottle. Next up, we have this Angry Mills uh, Protein Infused Almond Sprite. I've actually tried them before. Delicious. Um, I actually have... What did I dip in this? They had... Oh, those little... It, I made this so unhealthy. I mean, it's a it's supposed to be a healthy snack box, but I guess it's half healthy if you eat half healthy stuff, right? Let me make myself feel better. But I took those little mini um, M and M cookies that come in the little snack bags, and I would dip it in this, and it would taste absolutely delicious. Just a little tip for you: um, not a healthy one, but just an idea. Really good stuff. So next we have a mini size that's it bars. We have apples and dates. It's a mini fruit bar. So let's take a look at this. I'm not caring too much for how it looks on the inside, but let's take a bite and see. Mm. It's interesting. It's not bad. The taste kind of reminds me of the filling of a, a Fig Newton, but a bit healthier, not so processed. Um, mm. Ingredients is apple and organic dates. So like I said, it's like a unique texture, but it's not gross. It's actually surprisingly good. I just wasn't expecting it to be, you know, so good based off of the way it looks because the way it looks reminds me of some of the snacks I've tried that's kind of terrible. So next up we'll check out these uh, original, I'm not sure how to pronounce their name, but some gluten-free oat grams. Three little packs of those. So let's see what these are all about. I feel like I kind of crushed up a little bit, but I could be wrong. So you can see, this is our cookie. Okay, so it's like two cook. Oh, I'm sorry, four cookies in each pack. Pretty thin. A little piece broke off. Perfect for bite size to try. Mmm, yeah, very good. Really good. It's very simple. Um, it's not like a sweet flavor, but it's not too plain either if that makes sense it's like it don't taste like a health cookie it tastes like a good cookie like a mm, I guess kind of like an oatmeal cookie I guess would make sense wouldn't it so really good I like these definitely a winner um next up bada bean bada boom garlic and onion crunchy broad beans I have never heard of these before and I have not tried them before, but first time for everything, right? So let's go ahead and I'm gonna use my scissors to open these just for the ease and convenience of opening it. You don't really need it, but so that's how it looks. It's a little bite size. Really crunchy. Mm, you don't want to taste the garlic and onion. I really like it. I'm really liking this. So definitely packed with flavor. Definitely a good choice of a snack. But one downfall you can see is half the bag is air. But the positive thing, from what I'm reading while some companies do this, is help protect the product on the inside from being broken and smashed up. And so... You can see that these are whole little nuggets for the bite-sized nuggets. It's not crushed up pieces. So if that's the case, they achieved their goal. 
And then we have another one. Remember that when I opened the, the, um, that, which one? The sesame honey one that I said was absolutely delicious? Well, the same brand has a milk chocolate one. Dry roasted chickpea snack. So, gonna open these. Again, I'm using my scissors to cut closer to where the resealable portion of the bag is. I don't know why companies have the tear thing when, when you tear it, you still have to cut it open. But it kind of looks like malt balls. Just let me give you all a better close up. Little mini chocolate bite sized pieces. Mmm. I'm pretty good too. I try a second one, kind of clear off that taste from that garlic and onion that we just had. Mm. Definitely pretty good. Out of the two, I definitely like this, the sesame honey one better. They're both good, but this one I like much better. Just FYI. So then next, we have a Libra Chili Lime Meal Bar. I've actually tried this before. I do not care for them. Um, I'm not going to open it just because I plan on actually donating this to somebody else. Since I'm not going to eat it and rather than opening it to waste it, uh, I'm going to put it in a donation bag. But it's, it's really unique. It's not that it's horrible. It's just, I mean, it's a meal bar. So it's kind of meant to, you know... Be a, I guess like a meal replacement maybe or make sure you get the nutrients if you can't eat a full meal but either way you know balanced nutrition sustained energy um it's not highly disgusting it's not but it's not oh wow oh my god let me keep eating it's it's an acquired taste if I have to be honest something you would probably need to get used to if you're not familiar or used to these types of products so it's just something to keep in mind as far as this goes and finally, Plant Fusion Complete Protein. Ooh, this one is a red velvet cake. I have not tried that. I'm used to getting this brand, but it's always vanilla, which is okay, but nothing fantastic to me. However, I'm really excited to try this. So basically, you just take this and mix it, and you know, like you do with typical protein powder to enjoy. So I'll have to take this and mix it up and actually drink it later on but it's vegan dairy free gluten free sugar free all that stuff so you might have to play around with it to find the right mixture for your taste buds but i'm i'm super excited about a red velvet cake flavor so that's about it for our fit snack box you can see they tossed in a couple coupons for some of the uh snacks that came in the box yay i like saving money so if you like to you want to try it you see it locally save a few dollars but that would be our fit snack box for November 2019. I hope this video was a little helpful to kind of demonstrate what to expect in the box. Um, and I'm super excited. So I'm going to go start snacking on those, the uh, honey, sesame seed, honey sesame seed snacks. I can't even talk now because I'm thinking about it. And if you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment and I'll do my best to answer them based off my experience.